Getting a job in robotics these days is honestly kind of hard, uh, but I think if you focus on these three things, you should be able to land your first internship or full-time job in no time. First is theory. The interview cycles of most entry-level positions out there will at some point try to test your knowledge on the fundamentals of uh, robotics engineering. So there's three big subject areas. There's uh, mechanical design, computer science, and mechatronics. I understand that these are gigantic subject areas, so I'll give you some topics to maybe prioritize. In mechanical design, you should definitely prioritize statics and dynamics, and maybe know a little bit of heat transfer. In computer science, you should definitely know your basic data structures. Um, you should know basic search algorithms, uh, understand complexity, um, and then you'll wanna know Python, and you'll wanna be at least familiar with C++. In mechatronics, you'll need to know motors, so understand when to use what kind of motor, so understand just difference between stepper versus DC, uh, understand gearboxes, what they do. Um, control theory is very important. You definitely need to know PID control at the very least. Um, familiarity with state space modeling is also helpful. Number two is experience. This I think is the most often overlooked uh, aspect. So you need to do projects that demonstrate that you have experienced troubleshooting, uh, real life problems that you've done hands-on work that isn't as structured as problem sets or homework assignments or tests. Um, so try to join a project team like Formula One vehicle or like rocket team. Uh, and if you can't, just try to do personal projects on your own. And I know it can be hard to like fit in time to do all these things, but I think doing a personal project is one of the things that can benefit you the most in the long run. Number three is communication. It is super important that you have at least one project well documented and put somewhere like a personal website or just like a PowerPoint. Um, it, you really need to show that you can talk about technical work in uh, an effective manner. This is really important in industry and it is a skill that they will try to probe for during interviews. Best of luck.